After last season's game being canceled due to COVID, Ohio prepares to take on its MAC East rival, the Miami Red Hawks, on Tuesday at 7.30 p.m. in Peden Stadium. Hello, everyone. I'm Malin Kaiser alongside Darius Sethna for WLUB Bobcat Showcase. Now, Darius, last week's game against Kent was a tough one to watch. What should Ohio take away from that matchup? Well, Malin, Ohio's offense has significantly improved, which has been a major step in the right direction. In their last four games, the offense has seemed to have found its groove and must continue to utilize their solid running game along with the skills of Armani Rogers at quarterback. But that defense against the run is still a problem. This past Saturday against Kent State, the Bobcats gave up 200 rushing yards. In their last road game against Buffalo, they conceded a grand total of 271 rushing yards that led them to blowing a fourth quarter lead in that game to the Bulls. This match is considered to be the game of the year for the Bobcats. What should we expect to see from them if they want to be successful? The number one focus for Ohio needs to be eliminating the gaps for Miami's run game to penetrate. Those running backs consist of Tyree Shelton, Kevin Davis, and Keon Mose. All three of them totaled for 121 rushing yards in the Red Hawks' 24-17 victory this Saturday on the road against Ball State. That's not the only weapon the Red Hawks will bring this week as their passing game is just as lethal. Ohio will have to bring their A game on Tuesday night in this crucial rivalry match. This game is going to be an exciting one to watch. This is Ohio's first week game this season and it's going to be under the lights. How will this atmosphere affect Ohio? First off, the Bobcats need to take a step away from football and look at themselves in the mirror. For the Bobcats, this game revolves around pride. I expect them to play hard and show that no matter what their record is, every play must be executed with maximum effort. I have no doubt the crowd will be electric. After all, this is the battle of the bricks. All I can say, Malin, is that I think we should be in for a dramatic contest at Peden on Tuesday night. Follow along for updates throughout the game and for post-game content here at WLUB Bobcat Showcase and on WLUB.org. Alongside Darius Sethna, I'm Malin Kaiser.